is angling for a slice of the cake as South Sudan looks to construct an oil pipeline to serve the greater Eastern African region. Our reporter Philip Keitani is in South Sudanese capital Juba attending an oil conference and now reports. With the South Sudanese government hosting its first oil and power conference here in Juba, the government of Sudan has come out strongly, asking investors to invest more in its oil sector, insisting that they have 3.5 billion barrels of oil in its underground reserves. We wanted to move aggressively in exploration so that we can discover and produce more, more, more. And instead of con concentrating on the producing blocks already, we wanted to explore more blocks. Now, the Sudanese Ministry of Petroleum now says it wants to increase its daily production from the current 130,000 barrels to 150,000 barrels by the end of this year and 280 barrels by the end of next year. We wanted to seriously move in refining because we in Africa, we are concentrating on actually producing and exporting it and then we have fuel shortages in the country. And that is a problem. And this is what is actually uh, killing us in the continent. Like Nigeria is producing 2.5 million barrels a day. And they are actually having difficulties in actually fueling their cars. The government of South Sudan is also looking for ways to build four new refineries in the country. And they are seeking the help of Kenya to have one of its pipelines go through Kenya. We have uh, the oil in Turkana. We have the oil in South Sudan. Then now we wanted to have a pipeline that can actually accommodate all of us. According to the South Sudan Minister of Petroleum, only 30% of its oil reserves have been explored so far and is calling on other investors to put in more money in exploring the remaining 70%. Philip Keitan, KTN News, from Juba, South Sudan.